right, I'm back with another tutorial. I did something else to my cab. Um, it really was inspired by the Yoga Flame I have, where I have uh, Yoga Flame, Big Blue, X-Men vs. Street Fighter, Marvel vs. Capcom on one. I really wanted the logos all shown instead of writing out the game title. So I started working on this project and figured it out. So this is normally how you do it. Um, I mean, actually, this is normally what you would see when you first launch. You have your two choices between on this cabinet, on my other one, there was four. So there was two more down here. Um, and I would just go up and down between those four, but it was too crowded to see all the games. Um, so here it is, you ready? Actually, one more time, here it is, you ready? Boom. So I have uh, a custom screen showing Bart and it shows the two titles I can play with the Simpsons. I go over, shows the two Turtles games. I go over, shows the consoles I have on RetroArch. And I go over, I have my site. So if I need to go back to Macro Droid or Nova, um, I can add more depending on what settings I need to go to. So that way I'm not having to worry about the keyboard uh, and doing the control in, or I mean Windows in, or Control Escape or alt tab i think is the other one we go ahead and try that out right now to confirm all right so alt tab goes back to the first screen and also pulls up the search bar let me see if i can actually drag that so if i wanted i can go ahead and add this to the settings too and this is what allows me to um, edit the different multiple screensavers. So if I want to go into that, show you what that looks like. And this is one part that does suck. It does rotate to the side, so you have to adjust it. So as you can see, I have five home screens with the different images. This one, of course, will be gone since it's going to be replaced there, but I left it there to show you the transition. Um, and that's in order. And then I just have the apps on each one. All right, so let me go ahead and set that up on Street Fighter to show you how you do it. All right, so once it's done installing, I'm gonna open it. Yes, to access everything. Uh, since I have four APKs, I need four screens plus one extra for settings. Uh, and later, whenever I add Retro Arch, I'll come back and add one more. So there's the five screens. Uh, you add more screens here and you take away more here. Uh, since it is sideways, I just move my trackpad sideways and do that. And then when you're selecting your image, it's gonna go back to regular view. So I'm just gonna click on that picture icon. It's gonna take me to my file manager pretty much and I can access images here. Um, actually, I'm just gonna click on images. And it's gonna show me all the images available. I scroll down. So this is actually only showing me what's uh, already accessed. Let me see. Images, pictures. Actually, it's under scan, uh, sand disk. I'm gonna do pictures. Scroll down. So I have two different versions: one with the logos like I wanted, and one text view if I decide to go back. So I'm gonna select that first one. Um, let's see if any of these work. Nope. Alright, so I'm back at the Simpsons cab. It did not work out on the Yoga Flame, uh, but I do need to update the wallpaper for Turtles. So I have it here. If I go to Nova Launcher settings, I can show you what. Um, 
I have my home screen for this wallpaper. It's five by five. Icon is 115%, labels off, padding, none by medium. If I go to that, show you what it looks like right there. So I am just pushing jump to go back. Attack is A. Uh, these are the different wallpapers here. So once again, go sideways. I need to change out this wallpaper because it currently has the two. If I click on that image, it'll go to my folder selection. I have this new image with more logos. So I'm just gonna select that one and that's it. So it's updating the image. I'm gonna go here to set it. I'm gonna do set wallpaper, home screen, and there we go. So if I do jump or right click, it goes back. If I scroll left, there it goes. So the new released APK for Turtles now has these four additional games that we're hitting. Uh, there is one more, I believe it's called Crime Fighter. It's currently not working. Um, I have not installed this AP APK, so I'll do that right now. So if I do control escape, go to system settings, or I just go to my last screen. You do have to pause. You can't just like click, 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 click. You do have to pause to go between screens. So I need to go to files. Uh, I don't need the recent. It's on a new USB drive. So I need to go here, go down to downloads. If I scroll down, this is the new APK. This is the original. Um, and then I did something different. Let's see if that one works. Continue. So I added the actual icon image. So that way when it installs, it has that and it's called TMNT plus. So you can find, like I said, you can find this new one at the same location as the others. So there's the new APK, it is installed. Now I just need to go back to the turtle screen Click and hold, drag this bar up, drag, click and hold the activity. It's gonna set it over here for now. If I scroll down, and there's Turtles Plus. If I click and hold that, edit. I was hoping the icon would actually show up better, but this was just a test, it didn't work. So I need to replace it with a transparent one. So here's my blank PNG, done. Turn off reshape, done. So now if I go down to that one, I'm gonna have to replace it with the other one. I'm gonna give all these permissions. And here it goes, here's the new APK. So there's those two games. And now we have main event. Metamorphic Forces, Vendetta, Punk Shot. Let's try it out. So this one works. Let's go back to live. Yes, I want to leave. Main event. 
So like I said, I believe the other one is Crime Fighters, which does not work currently until they release a new updated version. They get it working and um, the last one works on some people and not on others. So I'm gonna select a wrestler. So I'm going to exit this one. Vendetta works and Punk Shot has not been working on everyone. So let's see. It loads. It goes through. Going to do one person. Start. And it seems to work on mine so far. Never even played this before. All right, so it works. Live. Exit, and the other one was Vendetta. I don't know if this was. Alright, so all those games work so far. The new additions Turtles in Time. So the buttons are still backwards on this. But here we go. So all the games work. Then I can just do volume down and return. So now with this new APK installed, I can delete this old one. And then I'm gonna drag this new one up here. So if I want to play these six titles, I go here, those two games there, these consoles here, and then just any settings. All right, have a good one.